Hi, I'm Salvador Yanis here at the Los Angeles premiere of Food Chains with Red Carpet Roomba. Hi, I'm Brooke Williamson and I'm here with Red Carpet Roomba. What exactly motivated you to stand up and support fair labor laws? I think it's it's a given in this industry. Um, being a chef, being somebody that works very closely with farms, being somebody that works very closely with, with food and produce, I feel like um, if, you're, if you're not making your voice heard, then you might as well not have an opinion. What exactly do you hope that the audience takes away from experiencing this film? I actually haven't seen the film yet. I'm very excited to see it. So I feel like I might have more of an opinion once I see it. Um, I'm curious to see what I'm going to take away from it. But, um, you know, I think that the exploitation of, of farm workers is something that is not incredibly well known about and something that's very important. So, you know, I'm, I'm excited for people to sort of educate themselves a little bit about that subject. How exactly do you feel that this issue affects everybody? Everybody supplies themselves with, with goods, so just as I feel like you should know where your product comes from, you should also know where that product, um, how that product is maintained and, and who picks that product, where that, from point A to point B, how it gets to you and, and your table. You look obviously very, very stylish, you can see that. Um, <laughs> tell us a little bit about your look tonight. Um, you know, I'm red carpet casual, I suppose. Uh, you know, I'm kind of simple, just dressed in black tonight. I've got my, my leather jacket, which is dressing up my black jeans a little bit. Just a, a tank top underneath. Uh, my jewelry by Jessica Elliott, who's also my sister. And some, uh, some nice Italian heels to sort of spike it up a little bit. Nice. You could describe your style in three words. What would they be? Ooh, three words. Um, comfortable, casual, edgy. Three beauty secrets that you always stick with you on the road. Ooh, three beauty secrets. Uh, eye cream, because you never know how much sleep you're actually going to get. Um, Tylenol, because you never know how you're going to feel. And lip gloss, because it never hurts to, to try and dress up your lips a little bit. What has been by far the best beauty tip that you've received? Uh, don't overdo the makeup. You know, I think that uh, simplicity in, in makeup and style um, generally goes a lot farther than overdoing it. I, I, I think that more makeup actually makes you look a little bit older. And, um, what are some of your favorite stores to go shopping for some quick, stylish kind of looks that you can put together for either a night out or something like this? Sure. No, I think that uh, I think that style. Um, is really important and having an outfit especially if you're traveling and doing so many different types of events uh, is, is important to be able to have the versatility in it. Uh, a really nice uh, pair of skinny jeans that can be dressed up with heels, um, a great leather jacket and I feel like I could wear this during the day, um, perhaps not in the kitchen uh, but uh, this could be a day look, a night look and you know I, I'd shop at like American Rag, they have great jeans and um, all Saints is one of my favorites, um, but that's more of a splurge. So. Thank you so much for sticking with you. us. It's a pleasure. Thanks.